Hi everyone, it's me Gigi. Welcome back. I'm here with the hashtag altered paper clips 2023. This is the fourth time I'm videotaping this and I hope it doesn't die off on me. I what a terrible morning afternoon. Actually it's afternoon. Anyway, so let's get started. So it the Hashtag Alter Paper Clips 2023 is hosted by my friend, MJ, at My Paper Journey, co-hosted by Dale at Not Too Shabby Chic, and yours truly, Gigi, at Journal Gigi Hannah. Every Friday, we're all going to do something, and this Friday is my turn, and I get to do Paper Bag Retro. Well, I started the video, as I said earlier, and I actually filmed it three times. But here I go. This is what I came up with. Okay, this is my paper bag. This is just a paper clip. This is another paper clip. And then here I showed you how to make this. So I'm going to go back and put this to one side. And I'm going to show you exactly how I made this. And hopefully the camera won't turn off. So first of all, if you don't have a paper bag, like I do have brown paper bags. If you don't have one, get, cut yourself a, a rectangle out of a regular paper bag. And it doesn't have to be perfectly straight. As you can see, this is not straight. So then what you want to do, you're just going to fold this way. Okay. This is the ugly one, so I'm going to fold it over this way. As you can see, it's not straight, it's not perfect, but then that's me. So I'm going to go like that. Then you will fold a little edge up this way. So now here, I'm going to cut here, and I'm going to cut here. So now all you have to do is cut this in, okay, because you don't need that, and you can cut this here, let's see where the fold is, okay, because see I see another little fold there, and then you just cut that, okay, so what you're going to do is you're going to close this, or oh, I can cut a little bit more, did you see that, okay, there we go. So all now you're going to do is fold, fold, and this will fold up. And that will be your bag. See that? So let's do it. Let me show you how I did that. So I'm going to take this glue here. This is going to go on top. So this has to have the glue. So it's going to be this here, my glue. This here, my glue. Okay, so that will glue that way. Did you see that? Might need a little bit more glue there. Let me do that that way. There we go. Now, I'm going to get this part and glue it up. And there's your bag. Simple as that. And that's actually, where's my bag? That's this bag right here. And then you can cut a little edge off. See that? So let me show you how I did the paper clip. You're going to put your paper clip right through here. Okay. So. not that hard. I'm just going to push it down as far down as you want to go. Okay. And inside here, all you need is a little piece of paper. On the other one, I actually put a bigger piece because the inside of my other bag was green. So 
of now. Okay. So that's going to be, that's going to glue down my paper clip there. And like I said, all you have to do is cut, cut a little hole. You can use, you can use just about anything. Let's see if I could do this like I did with the other one. I just freehanded it. I just want to do a little bit like this. And then you'll just do a little turn like that. The easiest way to do this actually would be to um, use a circle cutter. Okay. So that would be the paper bag. I'm going to use this paper bag to embellish with, like I said, this is what I had made. This is what I had made. And this is just a regular paper bag that I do have paper bags. But I wanted to show you how you can make your own paper bag. So on this here, since everything's going to be just slightly simpler, due to that I can't believe what happened so now I'm gonna put this here Oops. I think it needs just a slight little edge cut off here like this there we go yep. I would have put um I don't have any, do I? Muslim. I do, but let me see what color I have here. Maybe. I might try and see if this worked. This is more like that gauzy stuff. So how's everyone doing? I hope you're enjoying this series or this challenge here. And I hope you guys join in. There we go. I'm going to put this piece just like that to give it a little bit more. Yeah. I'm going to stretch it a little bit. Or do I do it like this? I could. And then maybe do this side over here. Yep. I, like I said, I started filming. And then I must have got a phone call. I know I had a phone call. And I didn't answer because I was recording and I don't know if that shut down my phone and I didn't realize and then I restarted it and my daughter said I'll help you mom um, we'll just join the videos together well she had to go do a quick errand her little puppy well he's not a puppy he's an old senior citizen um, he was outside and he starts to bark and he would not stop barking. I mean, it was bad. It was bad. So I had to stop the camera, go over there. And of course, once I went over there, he came inside and he was a happy camper. So then I started another video, but that just didn't go very well. Okay, I'm gonna put this here on the bottom. Okay. Just, just a piece of cardstock, but it's kind of thinned out. I'm just going to put this here. Okay. And then I have this. And I know I have a little bit. I do. I have it here. I'm just going to put very little bit on here. Not everyone likes to 
um, distress and you don't have to distress. Okay. There. That's just going to go there. Close this. And I'm going to go around. And you could use glue stick. I just find the fabric uh, tack glue a little bit faster for me or easier. So now, there you go. And then you can do uh, maybe a little bit of ribbon or I would put some ribbon up here. Put it, you know, just like I did with this, just a little piece of ribbon. So there's that one. That's the paper bag, the homemade paper bag. And so I wanted to show you this one, which is this here and this here. So there is um, Lori from uh, Girl on a Ridge. And I absolutely love her videos. And I saw her make a paper clip years ago. So this is what she did. She puts her paper clip in between two pieces of paper. And actually, she just folded it up and she tore it. She didn't cut it. I cut mine up. Okay. Is this the one I wanted to do? I think I wanted it a little bit wider. But we're just going to go ahead and, yes, I'm going to, I might have to do it on here. But to show you what I did was... And I'm going to uh, link her video if I can find it. Because I think, I want to say it's three, five years old. There we go. So now, you put your, right there, your glue. You go all the way to the top. And then I would just put glue all over. But most of it right there, because that's the most important. And then you just folded and like I said she had brown paper I think it might have even might have even might have even been um, coffee dyed paper and she just tore hers this way she folded it in half just like I did right here and then she just tore the edges of hers so this is what I have but I believe I'm going to use this one because it's a bit wider I'm going to try to put this car there. Now, same thing, a little bit. Go around. Yes, she's a little pale. My printer is not printing. But you could see a little bit of her. And her car. I call this the Mary Kay Pink Cadillac. You all remember that, don't you? And I think, do I want this on the bottom? I do. Okay. So let's do this. Let me put it just across. Put this on the bottom. And you notice it's just a little piece of paper. I cut this here. Okay. The car. Her car's going to stick out a little bit. I might. Leave it like that. Let me just do it like this. Let's do it. So I hope you all have been following us, and let us know how you like the uh, our uh, videos. We love to hear from everyone. I might just bend that. Maybe. This is okay. This comes out a little bit. I'm 
I'm going to do it like that. A little bit here, a little bit there. I might just leave that out that way. I should have probably moved the car over a little bit. Oh, okay. Here's retro. And I'm doing that because that's what I did here. I just did not put any lace underneath there. so it won't look so blank. A couple little black pieces. You could. Let's see. Do I have any more? If not, let's go for something else. No, I am going to put this down here. I'm going to glue that there. I think I'll do it in the back. Glue that in the back. Okay. And then I'm going to cut this here. There we go. Oops. Don't think these scissors were very happy here. So sorry I put this plastic so it would not make that noise and what am I doing I'm making the noise I wish I have um, another piece of that black do I I thought I had another little piece let me look I, I do but it's really small maybe maybe I can just put a piece across and then put this on top. No, because you don't see it. I'm just going to put this little dot there. Just like that. One, two, three, four, five, six. And move you over quietly. And move you over. So that's it. See that? That's it. This is closed, and then you can just put a ribbon up there. Um, I would probably put a white or a black ribbon uh, on this girl here, which is this one. You can put a little necklace. See that? I'm gonna I'm gonna try to do it, even though my hands are pretty bad right now. So anyways, so I apologize everyone that I had to redo this and sorry MJ that it took me so long, but it's done. Are you clogged up? Let's see. Let's see if I can unclog this little. The one thing about even though, yeah, that glue so thick. If anyone can tell me how I can thin out my fabric tack, I'd really appreciate it. it. Maybe someone can let me know. It doesn't want to come out. Does it not work in the little bottles? I thought I've seen people have them in the little bottles. So let's go with plan B. And that would be, let me cover this up. Maybe I plugged it up. Okay. Here's plan B. I'm just going to get my little beads here. I'm just going to put a little bit. There we go. I'm going to put this down, curve it up, 
curve that part up. I'm going to hold it for a little bit because, of course, it doesn't dry right away. Okay. Come on. Wear your necklace. My mama used to wear necklaces. Pearl necklace, too. I think a lot of our grandparents did, or, or parents, depending on... Um, what era they were in. Once in a while when I see an elderly lady with her pearl necklace, I'm like, oh. There. So there you go. See her little necklace? I'm not going to try to move it. I'm not going to try to move it so it will stick. So this one's a little bit more curvier. So these are it. Let me know in the comments what you think. And like I said, I probably would put like a little, I could do this right now. Let me show you really quick. And I do the same there. I don't have black snug hug. I'm gonna twist this a little bit. Or else I'd put a black snug hug in there. Just a simple little ribbon like this. And you could probably even make it a, a nicer piece of sari or ribbon. So there you go. Let me know what you think. Um, I appreciate every single one of you. If you like this, please put a thumbs up. Like, subscribe. Go check all the other girls' channels. You will absolutely love it. Thank you, everyone. Have a wonderful weekend and have a blessed day.